there will be an event which is getting triggered and there must be the file which is Hey everyone, today one of the coolest thing which I observed, let's talk about Geo Savan and Spotify, the music serving platforms. The way they serve the data from back end to the end user, let's see how it works. So here I have Spotify opened and logged in and here I have my Geo Savan. Let's just play the song and let's see like how the data has been pulled from the back end. Let me uh, just open up the developer console so that we can see like what all events are being triggered when we play a song on the back so let me just click on play and go to network and you can see like geo Savan is playing one of the songs and if you notice the events which is happening here you can see like there is an mp4 file which is being downloaded and this is this is the exact file which is there and this is the complete file which is actually downloaded into the system and getting played but there is much more security when we talk about uh, the Spotify so let me just play a song So when I play a song, there will be an event which is getting triggered and there must be the file which is being pulled and let me check out for the media. Yes. So here is the difference. Like you see the file size is exactly the 4, 4 minutes and 20 seconds. But this particular data will be coming in 9 seconds chunk from Spotify whereas in GeoSavan the data will be coming, the full file will be downloaded at once whenever the user clicks on the play button. You can see that exactly the 9, 9, 9 seconds. And that's it. So that is what the difference is like how the data is being served to the user so <clears throat> i think geo needs to take care more of this particular uh, piece of security thank you and stay tuned and if you want to know how to hack the algorithm for youtube just click on the red button down there thank you